Hey everyone, Matt Minster here, coming to you live from the Midwest, where it's a balmy seven degrees out, which is a welcome departure from the 20 or 30 below that we had last week. Why am I out here? Well, remember when those windows went in? Before Renewal by Anderson replaced those windows, this week would have been downright almost dangerous, certainly painful. But ever since we've installed these new windows, things have changed inside. We're toasty and warm on days like that. So let me take you inside and show you how things have changed. When I knew I wanted to replace the windows in this house, it meant a lot to renovate with respect to these blueprints on the wall. The history of this house, the architect, Ralph Rapson, and Renewal by Anderson let me do it, even down to the black framed windows that were a part of the original design of this house. We were able to keep them, and it looks pretty awesome. Okay, so this is the money window. This is the big show-off piece of the entire living space. And before, it was window panel, window panel. Big, but cloudy. Huge broken seals, cloudiness right in the center of this, basically at eye level where you'd be looking at the window. So now, how do we solve it? Crystal clear, unbroken seal glass, one big panel. So now, the view to the backyard is almost completely uninterrupted floor to ceiling. So this window was a huge pain point. This is in my son's room. This is the one where the window frame was literally rotting away, which made his room probably 10, 15 degrees colder than it needed to be. But now with the fibrex material, I know that's a problem. Never have to worry about it again. Well, Minnesota winters are tough, and there can be stretches of winters if you live here or live anywhere in the Midwest where we can get some pretty violent polar vortex minus 20, minus 30 temperatures out. With these new windows, it's news to me. If I'm inside here, it's warm and toasty no matter what the temperature is out there. From an energy efficiency standpoint, one thing I have noticed is in the summer, the AC doesn't kick on as often. In the winter, the furnace doesn't fire up as often. I know I'm spending less money. The temperature in this house is more regulated and more consistent just because we've got a tighter envelope with these windows everywhere. All right, there's your window update. But if you wanna see this project from beginning to end, step by step, it's all on my website, getinspiredwithmatt.com.